what's going on guys welcome back to the channel today's video i'm going to talk about soft plastics and simplifying what you're buying for soft plastic colors so we're going to talk about this in the basic aspect and then we'll go a little bit more advanced as we get further into the video so if you are a hobbyist who likes to go fishing every once in a while and maybe you're on a budget and you don't want to spend a ton of money but you want to be able to do everything there's two colors for soft plastics that's all you need two colors for each style so creature baits two colors worms two colors uh craws two colors that's basic and those colors are quite simple i mean it's a black and blue of some sort this is a missile baits d bomb in the bruiser color um, so that's black and blue and more likely green pumpkin green pumpkin is going to be for more of your clear water lakes and if you're in dirtier water and muddy water black and blue so if you really want to break it down to the basics green pumpkin black and blue should get you through pretty much any scenario you have fishing i mean any any time so if you're ready to go and step that up then the first thing i would say is still buy green pumpkin still buy some sort of black and blue and then mix in a color that you have confidence in so for me june bug is like my go-to color if i'm looking for a big bite or if i'm in the heat of the summer for whatever reason june bug I have a ton of confidence in that so I would buy green pumpkin black and blue and June bug uh, maybe your confidence color is watermelon red uh, totally totally fine everybody has a different um, characteristic um, what we're not going to talk about today we're not going to talk about imitating shad at all or your bait fish at all because that's a whole nother ball game but for soft plastics green pumpkin black and blue if you want to mix in a third get that June bug or um, any color that you have a lot of confidence in. So I hope that helped. Um, I know it can be overwhelming looking on Tackle Warehouse or Omnia um, at these soft plastics and you know Zoom for example or Missile Baits even. You know there's probably 20 or 30 color options for these and it can be overwhelming. So if you want to get it down to the basics, green pumpkin, black and blue, um, that will cover you for 98% of anything you're going to do. Um, yeah, I mean, hopefully that helped. Um, for the more advanced angler who maybe does tournaments or, or wants to do tournaments or really just wants to be prepared for the scenarios that may come forth, I would highly encourage to figure out what the craw looks like in your, if you have craw, what the craws look like example up here is alabama craw matches really well with what we have for the main craws in the spring so i would know an alabama craw color would work um, you might be in a different scenario where a bluegill imitator makes more sense or uh if you're in a shad lake maybe maybe buying a kai tech that's electric shad as opposed to a green pumpkin you know these are totally kind of geographic dependent um but the concept of green pumpkin, black and blue stays true throughout the country. So hopefully that helped. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, smash that like button, comment down below. We'll catch you guys on the next video. Thanks for watching.